Good morning, everyone. I'm Yuxin. I work in the GCEI PIM team here at Google. Um, a few days ago, I helped my friend Cassie, a brilliant fashion designer, to take her brand, the Pancake, to the next level. Pancake is the golden retriever. It's the mascot of GRPC. And Cassie has been running a very successful physical store for many years. Her store just sells GRPC and golden retriever merchandise. But this year is our first time going online. We used the Gemini to web code the website and deployed the service on a Google Cloud VM instances. We got everything set up just in time before the big Labor Day sale. <laughs> and Cassie's calling me, so maybe let me answer the phone. I wonder how the sales are going. Hey, Cassie, how are you? Hey, Yushin. The Pancake website is down. It's not working. The Labor Day sale is coming. Can you help me fix it? OK, so well, I, I guess we have a lab issue. This is a big deal. And maybe let's just check out the website. And it's 4-4. Mm, just give me a few moments and let me see if I can find anything. So here are my observations. First, the VM web server is restarted last night to apply an update. Second, the external IP address on the VM changed after the restart. I don't know what's going on here, but I guess we have a very clear mission. We need to fix the website get the IP address reserved, and maybe throughout all future updates, everything needs to be fixed before the big Labor Day sale. So let's get to work. So here we are in Pancake's Cloud Console. For most cloud users, including myself, when we are facing an incident like this, sometimes it's like solving a puzzle with a million pieces. I just don't know like where to go. I want to scan for global outages. I want to find like the most relevant public documentations. That's me being like really lost. But today we have Gemini Cloud Assist. So I just opened Cloud Assist in the side channel. It's like you have a cloud expert sitting next to you. And hopefully Gemini can help me out. So I will start everything by initiate a new investigation. And here, I will just paste in my previous observation. The external IP address of the VM changed, and I need a fix. And I can also set the time range to be maybe 15 minutes ago. And I can also attach the VM web server to this investigation. Our web server is an instance. So I'm filtering all the resources in my project by instance type. And then let me find the Pancake web server. There it is. So I selected this one, add it to my investigation, and just let me double check everything. So I have the right description of the issue, and I have the temperature site. Everything looks great, and I will click Create. So right now, underneath the hood, Gemini is doing all the analytics for us. It's first to create an embedding for our issue description in a high dimensional space. That's like a really high dimensional vector representing our understanding, our, I mean, the agent understanding of the issue and the user intention. And starting from there, it will start fetching the most relevant information regarding this intention and the current situation. And this information includes the difference in VM configurations before and after the incident, and also like, um, the like recent audit logs in the past 15 minutes, and can also cross-reference with like public documentations and the first-party Google engineers' domain knowledge. And now it's giving us the clear root cause. We were using an ephemeral external IP address that is temporary. So at, every time we start or um, recreate the VM, the address will change. And all we need to do here is to reserve a static external IP address and assign that to our VM. And Gemini even gave us the exact G cloud command we need to run. And look over there, it's, it filled in the, the VM web server that we created. So all I need to do here is take a few more moments, I just copy, paste the G cloud command, get the static IP fixed, and the website is back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Kevin. <laughs> so, yeah, so this is the future of developing and troubleshooting with Google Cloud Platform. Gemini can transform hours of troubleshooting into just like minutes of learning. And trust me, the troubleshooting process, it will just take less than the time to make a pancake. So 
Now I can call Cassie back and let her know the great news. Just a disclaimer, all images and videos in this slide, they are generated by Gemini, except the demo. The demo is real, and you can start using Gemini Cloud Assist today. It's in public preview, and it's very powerful, super helpful to your workflow. I encourage everyone to leverage Gemini Cloud Assist. Thank you, and I will give the stage back to Kevin.